I'm standing on the banks of the Yarra River at Newport. Behind me is the Goomai, a drag dredge used by the Port of Melbourne Corporation to dig up the riverbed. Unfortunately, the sediments in the Yarra River are contaminated from years of industrial runoff and contain dangerous chemicals and heavy metals such as arsenic, lead, cadmium, DDT and dieldrin. These sediments have been classified as unsafe for unconfined marine disposal under the National Ocean Disposal Guidelines. Despite this, the Port of Melbourne Corporation is going to bury 4 million tonnes of it in a hole covered by sand in the middle of Port Phillip Bay. The Greens say that in 2008 this type of behaviour is unacceptable by a state government and the Port of Melbourne Corporation. The Greens say this project should be stopped. The state government of Victoria has approved this project because it says it is needed so that larger ships can enter the Port of Melbourne. The problem is that the need for this is completely overstated. Most ships have no problem entering or leaving the Port of Melbourne at current depths. The state government has given approval to put this toxic material in the middle of Port Phillip Bay. That's why I've introduced a private member's bill into the Victorian Parliament to prevent the disposal of contaminated material in Port Phillip Bay.